Greetings. Greetings, brothers and greetings, brothers and sisters. As always, we bear witness there is no God but one. There is no God with him. There is no God besides him. There is no God equal to him. He have no partners. He have no rivals. He is God alone. We thank him for the way of holiness revealed to his servants for our learning. To all of our viewers and listeners, this is the Truth of God program again, our international headquarters campus is in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, here on the corner of Fifth and Lindley Streets, where you have a standing invitation to come, hear the Word of God preached according to what is written in the Scriptures. Now I'm glad for our guests being present. Is it Elder Smith or Minister Smith? Minister Smith from Brooklyn, New York, from the United Church of God in Christ. We thank God for him being present. And uh, he reached out to us. He let me know that my debating skills was flawed. And I thank God for such encouraging remarks. We're going to discuss the Trinity today. Either God says he's a Trinity or either God did not say he was that. So we're going to give him time. And we want everybody to listen. No interruptions. I don't want no moving around. I want everybody to listen because he represents the church of God in Christ and there's a lot of sincere people in that organization. I met many of them because many of them I baptize over in the name of Jesus Christ. Some of their elders are baptized over right out of their headquarters in Memphis in the name of Jesus Christ. So, we want to listen at the brother and hear his perspective, and hear his stand and his belief that God is the Trinity. Brothers and sisters, we're going to turn the microphone over. Brother Minister Smith of the United Church of God in Christ out of Brooklyn, New York. Brother Smith. Truly, I want to give an honor to your pastor, Pastor Gino Jennings, to all the dignitaries here, to all the men and women of God, to the matriarchs, to all this you know, wonderful people that serve this great setting. I'm here. Let me interject this. And you that is on the soundboard, turn the brother microphone up so they can hear him loud and clear so I don't have to keep interrupting. All right? All right. Thank you, sir. I'm here from Unity Temple Church of God in Christ in Brooklyn, New York, 623 Madison Avenue. I'm here on my own volition. My church did not send me, but I seen your pastor debating and I wrote a little email. I truly thank God for my minister, Raphael, that's in the audience. Raphael, stand up real quick. All right, stand. My, my father's here, Bishop Charles Smith. I guess he didn't get to the security protocol. But I just want to go on. No order or doors is due. Let's get in it. I'm not here to convince anybody on this afternoon to believe in the Trinity that's made up of three unmistakable persons. But I'm here to lay a thought, not through eisegesis, but through exegesis of the word. I did a brief research of the oneness movement. This theory was dispelled 
many centuries ago by the church farmers. It was classified as modalism. Modalism is based on God changing himself in modes. One mode, he is the father. Another mode, he's the son. And the last mode, he's the spirit. This teaching was erroneous. This teaching was heresy. The father, the, the church fathers, came up with a term, a Greek term, homo usius, to affirm that God the Son and God the Father was of the same substance. The modalistic teaching has crept back up in the 20th century as Jesus only, one God, one faith, one way. Due to this leaving, the ecumenical church and the Pentecostal church seven times in this fellowship, this teaching. Romans 16, 17 said, Now I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause division and offenses contrary to the doctrine which you already have learned. And it said, avoid them. Hallelujah. Due to this denial of the Trinity and the baptismal salvation, there was disfellowship. But I'm not here to talk about your baptismal salvation. That's another topic. I'm here to discuss, I'm here to discuss in scriptures, in reason and debate about the triune God that we serve. The name of God in Hebrew is El. It's in the singular pronoun. God is one God. We believe in the one solitary God. We are not tri-deists. We never state in our confession of faith that we believe in three separate persons. Hallelujah. We believe in a personal God that demonstrates his character, his nature, and his deity in the pre-existence and the existence of the world. We agree with Moses when he presents the Godhead in Genesis 1 and 1. In the beginning, God. The oneness church have a problem with that. Moses presents God as Elohim. He called God's name in the plural. Moses ascribed a coexistence to the Godhead with the Father. In Genesis 1, his name is not in the singular, but his name is in the plural. P-L-U-R-A-L. To truly understand Genesis 1 and 1, we have to use the Shema. Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Oh, hear Israel, our Lord God is one. Moses is saying, Jehovah, our Godhead, is one Jehovah. But when we take the Shemur apart and put it back together again, you miss out on the key word. That key word is one. The, script, the scriptures clearly teach that God is one. The scriptures clearly teach that God is three persons in one. There's two meanings, two types of meanings in the word, in the one. There's a Hebrew word that says, explains two Hebrew words. One is jakad. It speaks of a mathematical one. One is used about 12 times in the Bible. Genesis 22 and 2. Let us make man in our own image. Zechariah 12 and 10. And he shall look on the Son, the only begotten Son. It describes the unity, but it don't describe the unity of God. Moses used another word. He used a cod, where the word describes an absolute unity, a compound unity, and it's one. The first time Moses used the word a cod was Genesis 2, 24. That's your Bible? I know you got it. 
Genesis 2, 24. Can you get that for me, sir? I want y'all to see this for yourself. Genesis chapter 2 and at verse 24. Okay. Therefore shall a man leave his father and his mother, uh -huh. and shall cleave unto his wife, uh -huh. and they shall be one flesh. One flesh! Two become one. There's a union between man and the woman. It's a union together. They separate though. But when they come, when they marry, there's a union. They're what? One. Give me Ezra 3 and 1. So I just want to see how these words, this word Akkad is used in the Old Testament. Ezra chapter 3 and verse 1. And when the seventh month was come, and the children of Israel were in the cities, the people gathered themselves together as one man to Jerusalem. Stop right there. The people of God gathered themselves. They're what? Y'all gathered here today. Y'all what? One. We are one. Multiplicity of people, but we're still what? One. God is one. God is a collective. Give me Genesis 1 and 26. This is your favorite verse right here. Genesis chapter 1 and verse 26. And God said, let us make man Stop right like there. Image. Stop right there. Stop right there. That word God again. Plural. Check it out in the Hebrew. Plural. Elohim is a plurality of divine person. Man. Go ahead. Keep on reading. And God said, let us make man in our image after our likeness. Stop right there. In our image, one. Once again, one is presented in Genesis. Who wrote it? Moses presented it. God is plural. The Godhead is plural. It's divine. But the one, the unity of God, is a compound unit. The oneness is God. It's a mathematical or numeric one. The oneness appeal to illogical concepts. The God is the number one. Nowhere in scripture, God is considered the number one. Nowhere, you can't find it. It's not in scripture, God is not the number one. You can't use mathematics to describe God. The one God is the compound unity. And the God has there are three center of consciousness, spoken as the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Three persons in the one God. They are indivisible, recognizable, undivided, and all share the being of the one God. To truly understand, to truly understand, we have to look at Hebrews in the light, on the light of the Greek equivalent. So let's use those same two scriptures in the Greek. Mono is singular meaning absolute one and number one. Give me Matthew 24 and 36. St. Matthew chapter 24 and at verse 36. But of that day and hour knoweth no man, no not the angels in heaven, but my father only. Stop right there. Mono, only my father. Only he knows the day or the hour. Only my father. We're going to get to that later on, that toe text. Only the father. Give me Luke 5 and 21. Luke chapter 5 and at verse 21. And the scribes and the Pharisees uh -huh. began to reason, saying, Who is this which speaketh blasphemies? Uh -huh. Who can forgive sins but God alone? But God alone can forget, forgive sins. One, mono, mono e mono, mean passage in mono, one. There's another Greek word I want to use. It's called hen. H-E-N. It's not chicken. 
H-E-N. It's the plural meaning of a compound union or unity. Matthew 19 and 5. Let's see what Jesus said about this. Matthew chapter 19 and verse 5. And said, For this cause shall a man leave father and mother, and shall cleave to his wife. It's not like that Jesus said the same thing Moses said. It's a union. It's a union going on. Give me Mark 12 and 29. Mark chapter 12 and verse 29. And Jesus answered him, The first of all the commandments is, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Once again, he used the Greek equivalent word to the word akai in Hebrew. He used, he used him. Union. It's a union. It's unity with him and the Father. Ephesians 4. Sorry from the fourth, fourth verse. Get your Bibles out. Ephesians. I'm, I'm, I'm shocked at y'all. Get your Bibles out. Y'all should be following this. Ephesians chapter 4 and verse 4. There is one body. What? How many? Say it again. There is one body. One body. That's us. Come on. And one spirit. One spirit. The Holy Spirit. One spirit. Come on. Even as ye are called in one hope of your call. One hope of the calling. Okay. One Lord. One Lord. That's one. Jesus Christ. Go ahead. One faith. One faith. Go ahead. One baptism. One baptism. Go ahead. One God and Father of all. One God and Father of them all. One union. We all are in union right now. First Corinthians see, 8 and 6. I've got to do some scripture out here. You like that, right? First Corinthians chapter 8 and verse 6. Now this is, the, this is the equivalent of the Shemar in the New Testament. Paul is using it. He uses the, the Shemar. When, if a, you was a Jew and you heard Paul use it this way, you'd be shocked. Yes. First Corinthians chapter 8 and verse 6. But to us there is but one God. But to us there is one God. Go ahead. The Father. The Father. Of whom are all things. All things. Go ahead. And we in him. And we are in him. And one Lord Jesus Christ. And one in one Lord Jesus Christ. Conjunction together. By whom are all things? Stop right. The beginning of the book. Now, you like, debated Minister Young some years ago. Minister Young, y'all was really, well, go to 1 John 5 and 7. Y'all was really working. He couldn't answer the question. I, I watched the video. I studied. 1 John chapter 5 and verse 7. For there are three that bear record. There are heaven. three that bear record. Come on. In heaven. Come on. The Father. The Father. The Word. The Word. And the Holy Ghost. And, the, and these are? And these three are one. One, three, one, in union. Once again, one God, three and one. The, through precise exegesis of scriptures, we are able to observe the uniplural God of the scriptures. We believe in the eternal sonship of the Godhead. How much time I got? I don't want to be up here too long. We believe in the eternal sonship of the Godhead. We don't believe that God the Father created a body and put himself into it to get praise. Hold oh, yeah. I heard some ooze in there. I heard some ooze in there. <laughs> but we believe in the Logos who stood face to face with God. We believe the foreordained and pre-incarnate Son who, was, who created space, time, and matter, who was of the same substance of God. 
being and existing in the form of God. God is light. The sun was light. God is spirit. The sun is spirit. God is life. The sun is life. All things through him, by him, and for him. The Gospel of John 1 and 1. John did not describe the word in grammatical usage. He did not call God a verb. God is not a verb. He didn't call God is a noun. It's a him. It's not a verb. He's not act, just action. He would have called the God, if, he would have called God a, the glossary or the lexicon. He could have gave with names, I mean words. But he did it. Praise the Lord. Yes, sir. All right, you. Let's turn the microphones up on both of us, please. Brother Smith, I'm glad that you took the time to come. Appreciate it. Appreciate you bringing me down, sir. Respect the fact that you're here. Let me just get clear to you, because I don't believe that one should be misrepresented. Yes. Because your back was toward me while you was talking. Yes. You say you believe as one God. Yes, yes I do, sir. Is there another God with him? There's another God with him. Is there another God? No, there's not. The scriptures don't with teach the that. one. No. There are three in one. Three what? Three what? Divine persons. There's three divine persons Person, in the Godhead. Per, yes. Well, Isaiah. It's, can I get a scripture for that? Before you get your scripture. Okay. Do you have the same spirit that was in the saints of old? Yes, I do. The Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost. So having the same spirit that was in the saints of old, uh -huh. then that means you believe was written. Yes, sir. All right. I want everyone to listen at this, and we want to balance this out now. Right. Listen good. 2 Corinthians chapter 4 and at verse 13. All right. We having the same spirit of faith. Hold it. Now, if we got the same spirit of faith, that means we got to have the have the, we got to have the same spirit of belief. Yeah, sure. Our belief can contradict sure. the saints of old. Sure. Same spirit of faith, same spirit of belief. Sure. How should it be administered? According as it is written, that faith, that belief, have to be according to as it is written. We agree. Yes, sir. All right. According as it is written, I believe. And after we look at what's written, we believe it. Yes. And then after we look at what's written, we believe it, then we can do what? And therefore have I spoken. Then we talk. Yes, sir. Now, you got the same spirit, you said. Yes, sir. Same faith. Yes, sir. Lead the same thing. Yes, sir. As it is written. As it is written. All right. So this is what I want you to do. Being that you said there's three separate and distinct personalities. I did not say separate. They not divided. Being that you said there's three personalities yes. in the Godhead. Yes. I want it, as you just said, written. written. Mm -hmm. I want Bible chapter and verse that says God has three distinct oh, personalities. Oh, that's that's the red herring. Oh, no, no, no. That's, no, that's no. the red herring. Do you hear See, what wait, the Bible... Wait, 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 wait. Just a minute. See, this the, this, Just a minute. This, this, just this, a minute. Wait, yes, sir. Yeah. Listen, did you sir. Hear wait, what, wait, wait, wait. Did you hear oh, what sir. he just read? We oh, having sir. the that's, same spirit of faith. Listen, Do you listen, have the, the same listen, spirit of faith? Listen, sir. Brother Smith... Yes, sir. Do I you listen. have you, you, see, just you, a minute? The semantics of it. I took my time yeah. well, look, look, and look, let semantics. you talk. Use them semantics. How long you been ministering, Brother Smith? About ten years. Ten years. Yes, sir. Now, semantics. in ten years' time, yeah. you ought to be able to know what scripture okay. to go to to back up your talk. Okay. Ten years. 
Now, in 10 years time, you should be able to go to your Bible that says God have three distinct don't say the Bible. I personalities. Didn't say, I didn't say the state. This, whatever way what you word it, God have three personalities. Now, so let now, let me, the, just a I'm minute. Going, I'm going to answer G step. The Bible says whatsoever things are written, written the fourth time and written and for our learning. learning. Let me say this to you. Mm -hmm. Every church of God in Christ preacher watching. Mm -hmm. And if there's any here, you can't come face the truth of God with Hebrew, Greek, and Latin. No. The only thing work here is Bible. Amen. Bible works here. Your Hebrew, Greek, and Latin is good. But brother, it don't help you here. No, no. This is what you got to do. We this is what the Bible said. We having the same spirit of faith. And you say you got the same spirit of faith, which means the Holy Ghost in you that you claim must have the belief of the scripture. That's right. And then after you believe it, then what? According as it is written. According how? According as it is written. According as it is suggested. According as it is written. Made up. As it is written. Opinion. As it is written. I want it. As it is written, as it is written. you, give, you give, give Bible chapter and verse right now Isaiah. that says there are three personalities, three personalities. to the one God. Well, Amen. the Bible, let me say it. Let me say it correctly. I, don't, I want let that. Me say, sir, let me say it. The Bible, we observe, the key word I said, we observe the scriptures. That's what I want. I we want observe. you to observe it and read it. Okay, Isaiah 48 and 16. Listen. We're going to listen Isaiah, Isaiah 48, 48 and 16. 16. Yeah. And we want to see, does it say God have three personalities? Right. right. God, right. the Isaiah Bible going to show you. Let him read it. Let him read it. Let me, let me, before he read it. All right. The Bible going to show you three personalities. All right. Listen. Isaiah 48 and verse 16. Yeah. Come ye near unto me. Uh -huh. Hear ye this. Uh huh. I have not spoken in secret from the beginning. Uh huh. From the time that it was, there am I. Wait, 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 right there. That didn't wait, say it was three personalities. Wait, 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 hold on, let me finish. Let me say that. Wait, wait, wait. I want wait. Bible we, we chapter listen. and verse oh, that man. says hold it. God hold it. have listen. three personalities. Hold it. Hold it. Let me talk. Brother Smith, I'm let me talk. Let me let you, I let me want talk. you to talk Isaiah, that Bible. Amen. Isaiah 48. 16. He just read it. Read, say it again. What's that? Where did I stop the man? I want you to read where it says it had God have three personalities in Isaiah 48, 48, 16. 48, 48 16. 16. So remember, as it is written. As it as is, it is written. written. What did it say? Come ye near unto me, hear ye this. Uh -huh. I have not spoken in secret uh -huh. from the beginning. From the time that it was, there am I. There I, am I. Oh, the key. The word said, there am I. Somebody is talking. Who is it? We go find out right now. Hold it. Find out. Who is it? Right there. The Bible. Let the Bible tell us. Somebody is talking. Who Let is it? Let's find out who it is. 48, 16. Let's go. And, yeah. and now the Lord God. Now, listen. He said, now the Lord God, the Father. And his spirit. And his what? His spirit. And his spirit. Is that and a second one? No. Oh, no. This, we don't believe in separate. No. Is, we believe no, in three and one. Just a minute. No. I didn't ask you, was no, that no, a separate no, one? No. 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 I asked you, That's was a that second a... personality speaking. Read it where the Bible says that. Wait, so, no, look. Look. We exert. No. We exert somebody talking. Read it. Somebody's talking up in the heavenly. Brother Smith. They talk. Brother Smith. Um, they talking. Brother Smith. They're Bro talking. Just a minute. Just wait, a minute. wait, read the text. Just a minute, Brother read, Smith. Yes, sir. Is read God it. that spirit? Let's say God and his spirit. Is God that spirit? Let's say God and his spirit. All right, let's balance that okay. out. God, okay. Just a minute. Let's we're finish gonna, out. We're going to stay at Isaiah Listen, let, let's, 48, right. 16. He's right. finished. He's not finished. finished. We like to finish the text. 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 Brother Smith. We like to finish the text, sir. Just a minute. Can we finish the text? Just a minute. Can we finish the text? Isaiah 48, 16, 16. what he just read, just read. Uh -huh. says what? Come ye near unto me, hear ye this. Says what? I, I have not spoken in secret from the beginning. From the beginning. From the time that this is God talking. Right. God Almighty is talking here. Okay. Right. Oh. And the one God says. From the time that it was, there am I. From the time 
that it was that it was there am I there am we I uh -huh. us I them I they I what else is that and now and the, now the Lord God the Lord God and his the Father, spirit the Lord God and his spirit his, his spirit, spirit has who sent me sent me who's the me who's the sent one God oh you want me to God, no wait 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 hold it hold no, it no, hold it God wait 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 see this the modalism that listen this is modalism. Is it one God? No, it's modalism. Is it one no, God? No, it's modalism. Is, is it, it modalism? God? All right, that being that you won't the, answer, let's no, let no, the let, Bible no, talk. Let, Just a minute. I'm, I'm going to come back to that scripture. Give me the book of Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy. Chapter let's see. Seven. Let's see. Is it anybody with God? Deuteronomy chapter 32. Follow me. And verse 39. Church of God in Christ and this rotten, damnable doctrine you got here. Amen. That there's three personalities. Before you move from this pulpit, you better give Bible chapter and verse that say what you say. What you say. Before you leave here. That's right. It better say what you say. That's right. I want all you Church of God in Christ bishops that are watching. Amen. You better give Bible, I can give Bible that says that our God is one. Is one. There's none before him. That's right. There's none with him. That's right. There's none besides him. That's right. There's, I got Bible that Bible. say that. Amen. I want Bible that say what you said. I don't want you to say it. No. All right, give me Deuteronomy. Now Deuteronomy chapter Man, 32. You don't have no Bible. I'm going to get some. Deuteronomy chapter 32 and verse 39. That's what? See now that I. God talking. Amen. Singular. I. See now that I. Even I. Even I. Am he. And what? And there is no God with me. Oh no. Brother Smith said there's a second personality with him. There is no God with me. There's a second personality with him. There is no God with me. Is God alone? Amen. Is God alone? Let me Amen. explain something. Uh, no, no, no. Just, let, is let that me, the truth? Is, me, is there me, another God me with me him? Brother Smith just answered the question. Pastor, sir, Amen. Sir, let me Brother, explain something. all you got to do. I'm going to explain it. Is God yeah. alone? Listen. I'm going to explain it. You know how many times that, you know, there's a murderer at one time. I don't want that. No, 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 no. Listen, hear me I now. don't want that. Now, no. how many times he mentioned the singular. Is God The Bible testifies. Alone. The, God, the Bible text will testify of God in the, the church singular. of God in Christ is looking at you, Smith. Yes. Amen. You're Look, doing a poor a job heart. representing them. Let me talk, sir. No, you're going to talk that sir. Bible talk. Yeah, that's that's right. talk. It's listen, God alone. Listen, let me, I let, listen, let me. The Bible is speaks God, God in the singular in the Old Testament. Alone. He speaks in the singular in the Old Testament. Is there another one with him? He speaks in the plural in the Old Testament. Is there another one with so him? So in this text, he's speaking in the singular. Is there another one with him? When he's speaking, he's speaking as a singular God. Brother Smith. He's speaking as a singular God. Is there another one with him? He's speaking. There's no other God. Is he by himself? There's, there's no other God. Yes, he is by himself. Is he alone? Yes, he is alone. Is he God alone? Yes, he is God alone. And there's only one. There's only one God. And he have no partners. Oh, he's hold it. <laughs> ah. Amen. Let's get Bible. Now the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 4, and verse 8. Hold it. We got him. We got it him. didn't take long. Amen. It didn't take long. Amen. It didn't take long. Amen. We got him. We got him. It don't take long. All right. Let's wait, wait. Let me explain that. that. Let me explain. I don't that. want your mouth. Job. I don't want your mouth. Job 26 and 13, please. Smith. Job 26 and 13, Listen. please. Job you can call all the scriptures you want. Please. Miss. I want Bible chapter and verse. That Job says 26 and 13. God have three personalities. The Job 26 and 13. Give Job 26, 26 13. 13. Mm -hmm. And let's see, does it say God say have three personalities? Job chapter 26 and verse 13. Listen. By his spirit. By who what? By his spirit. By his spirit. He has garnished the he heavens. He garnished the heavens. Is He's, that God? Listen. He, that's God. That's God. He's garnishing the heavens. Yes. That's God. That's God. 
So what? That's what, God. That's scripture. That's God. That agrees that's with God. me. That's God. I believe that. And you believe because it? I believe that's God. That's God. Because he got three personalities. There's three personalities in one. Read it. In one. Read it. In one. Read it. Read it. Let's go to. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. I got scripture. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Read it. Let's go to. Brother Smith, listen, you know, you know listen, our belief got to be written, listen, right? Listen. listen. Let's you know your bishop told listen. you not to come here. That's right. Because he told you you would lose. Amen. Your bishop told you not listen. to come here. Listen. Amen. Listen, hold it. Amen. Listen. Your hard head. Go back to Isaiah. And I'm going to spank you with that Bible. Isaiah 48. Let's go back to Isaiah 48. Isaiah 48. Let's go. Let's start. Let's start from the 12th verse. Now remember, you that are here and you that are watching. Start from the 12th verse. All the scriptures he's reading, uh -huh. we're just waiting for up. one of those scriptures right. 12, to say 12, that Isaiah, God have three the, personalities. We observe That's what three we're waiting people on. of the Godhead. We observe what? Three personalities of the Godhead. Right. Isaiah 48 and 12. Isaiah Please. 48 and verse 12. Hearken unto me, O Jacob and Israel. Uh huh. My call, I am He. I am He. I am the first. I also uh, am the uh, last. Uh huh. What else? Mine hand also hath laid the foundation Stop of the right earth. there. He said, "My hand has laid the foundations of the world." We saw it in Job twenty-eight and sixteen. The Holy Spirit laying the found, garnishing the heavens. And we look. If we go to the New Testament, we see Jesus making princes of palaties, dominions, in the New Testament. And Jesus the, is all person in God one! All the Holy Spirit, the Father, and Jesus. How many is it? The Holy Spirit, the Father, and Jesus How many is in it? union. How many is it? In, you, in one. How many is it? In one. In one. Are they separate? In one. In one. They're undivisible. You can't divide them. they all in one. Let me ask you all questions. in one. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Let me ask you a question. I'm with you, sir. I'm with you. Yeah. Is yeah. Jesus Christ God? Yes, he is. Is he God? Yeah, he's the true God. He's the true God? Yeah, he's the true God. He's the only one God? He's the true God. Did the Bible, he's the true, he's did the the, true God. Did the Bible ever say uh -huh. anywhere? That way we don't take up my mm -hmm. entire telecast with this. Sure. Right. Let's bring it to a nutshell. Mm -hmm. Did the Bible say at any time, any time or in any place that God had? Because God know what he is, correct? Do God know who he is? Wait. Yes, he does. Do God know who he is? Yes, sir. Do get God know to, what he is? Yes, sir. Do God know how he is? Get to the nutshell. Do God know how he is? Get to the nutshell. All right, then being that God know who he is and what he is, would you please show me where God said to anybody, he's three personalities. Listen. Once no, again, you listen. Now, get the chapter listen, and verse listen, right now. Listen. If you yeah. don't once have again, it, sit down. Once yeah. again, sir, listen. You either get that scripture or sit down. Amen. You either get that scripture. No, it ain't no listen. Get the scripture where God says he got three personalities because you agree. Jesus Christ is God and Jesus said believe on him as the scripture have said. So get the scripture where he said he got three personalities and if you don't, sit down. Listen. I appreciate Give listen, the scripture I right now. I appreciate thank that you. That says you. he got listen, three personalities. Listen, I appreciate I appreciate Brother everything. Smith. Thank you. Get the scripture. God, for your, thank you, truth for God. <laughs> you ain't you got none, do you? You ain't got none. I just not going off that premise. You, you ain't know, got none. None off that premise. You ain't got none. None off that premise. You listen, none. Either you got premise, it or you don't. None off that premise. You should have it. It's no, your belief. Listen, not off that premise. And you should have that's it. Not off, oh, that's your belief. Your premise. It's your that's belief. Your premise. Do you believe that's God got three personalities? Listen, that's your premise. We observe three persons of the Godhead. That's what I tell you. All I ask you to do, being that you observe it, we observe it. We want to observe it. Don't we, folks? Amen. But we want to observe it. Thank you. Thank you. Would you please help us observe by getting the scripture so we can observe the chapter and the verse that says No, it does not say that. It won't say that, sir. It won't say it like you said it. It's not gonna say it like that. We Respect. having the Respect. same. I'm an elder, sir. Respect. Respect. I'm an elder. Respect. It wants to thank you. Sir. Find the scripture. Right. Listen. Okay. Listen. Find it. 
find the scripture. That scripture. Smith, hold on. Hold let on. me teach you something, hold son. In a biblical up. discussion, listen. I'm, listen. ideas okay. and theory idea. don't work. Modalism is a let me score you. Modalism the Bible says out. this. Whatsoever, I'm trying to help you. No, no. Listen, I'm really trying I, to help no, you. You're not the, helping. Not listen, on your premise. I'm trying to help you. Not on your premise. Let, let me teach you something. Premise. You not know why? Premise. You know why? Not on your premise. You know why the church of God in Christ can't okay. touch what I preach? Because what I preach is in the Bible. No, you know no, 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 no. That's why you can't no, touch no, it. No, no, no. You can't touch it, Smith. That's why you can't touch it. Give Bible. That's all you got to do. All you got to do. That's why the church of God in Christ can't touch it. Now, I'm declaring. I am declaring to the church of God in Christ, Amen. every bishop and every elder Amen. and every pastor, Amen. because you failed to live up to your teaching. Nope. And being that you failed, let me tell you bishops from the church of God in Christ, Amen. this is your student. Amen. Bring me your overseer. Amen. Pull up Amen. your center. Amen. Bring me your overseer. Amen. I respect your effort. I respect. Can I say something? I respect your effort. Can I say Amen. But brother, I respect your effort. Sir. You bishops from the Church of God in Christ. Amen. I credit your student. Yeah. Because he got more nerve right. than the overseer. Amen. Fail, son. No, I don't. Listen, if I thought to come here to get a victory, I would have been stupid. That would be the wrong thing. To go into the lion's den Amen. with the lion. Do you feel the bite? No. <laughs> no. That's, that wasn't the mission. Amen. That's not the mission. That is not the mission. That's not the mission. That's mine. That's not the mission. That's my mission. That's right. My the mission is to take every piece of listen. damnable doctrine okay. and seek listen. my biblical teeth and thought and rip it to shreds. My That's my mission. Listen. I, I, I can't overcome I rip it to shreds. That's not my mission. That's mine. Amen. That, okay, can I talk? That's not, if I was going to come down here I, to come to try to, to get a victory here. That, that's not my mission. That's the wrong thinking. Mm -hmm. That's the wrong. I would have been an immature minister to come down here to think like that. Well, you want to know something? I was, I'm a mature minister, okay. and I um, think like that. Okay. Listen, Amen. check this out. I, I want you all to listen to this. So the reason why we sever ties with the oneness was they take in salvation away from people. How can you say you believe in one listen. and then talk about you sever ties? Listen. Listen, Do you believe listen, in one? We sever ties because of that statement, and that makes y'all that makes it a cult. What is? That makes that a cult. Because of what you statement? Set your, when you set yourself up like that, when you like set, what? When you set yourself to take away salvation from what? people like Dr. King, for Harriet Tubman, what? for all these people that I labor, am, that listen, labor. We that ain't labor. having a dream listen, here. No, no, it's not a dream. No, sir. I don't want to hear nothing about no Dr. Listen, King. Listen, listen, sir. Do you believe it's one? Listen, listen, I believe God is one. You believe God is one? God is one. He's alone. He's one a, alone. The text says he's alone. Is he, does he have partners? When, listen, when, in Isaiah, when does he says... Does God listen, have partners? Listen, check this out. Hear me out. When that text says... Brother listen, Smith, can I, let me hear me, do me God listen, have partners? Ask Moses. What did Moses vote? What did Moses vote? Moses what, said he got partners. What did Moses... He inspired it. Moses what did said, Moses, hero Israel. He could. Lord, Moses Lord, 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 Lord. It's Elohim. What's Elohim? Is he a partner? Is it Elohim? What's Elohim? That's he, that's What's God. Elohim? It's God. How many? One. But no, Elohim don't mean one. What? It means plural. Who is the second one then? Listen, what, what's the name of the second? It's a Godhead. Who's the second? So John revealed it. He's asking. The Logos, the Son, Jesus. The divine Son, Jesus. John revealed it. See, what he using philosophy. Vain philosophy. All we right. don't use philosophy. All He's right. philosophizing to y'all. All right, listen. He's philosophizing. Let's, let's see his passage. Jen is using philosophy. Philosophy. Or let's see. Is it, just a minute. Yes, sir. Let's see. Is it a second one? Right. Let's see. Do he even have a brother? Right. All right, everybody, follow me. 
Follow me in your Bible. In the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 4. Listen at this. And at you you, you that are watching, and I want you to listen too. Amen. Listen. In Ecclesiastes chapter 4 and verse 8. All right. There is one alone. That has what? There is one alone. And? And there is not a second. Oh. Just a minute. Just a minute. I'm not done. Amen. There's one alone. And there is not a second. If it's not a second, it can't be a third. Amen. Now listen. Yay. I, I want you to listen at the rest of it. Yay. Yay. He has neither child. Oh. He have no child, so nor, he ain't. And what else? No brother. Oh, he ain't got a brother either? No brother. W would you please? Give Bible chapter and verse once and for all. Once and for all. Where God have three personalities. Let me call give you the chapter. Call Isaiah, call the verse. The sixth chapter, starting from the verse first. All right. Isaiah chapter six. Isaiah chapter six. And we'll start at verse one. We're going to see, does this say he got three personalities? Watch this. In now the, listen. In the year that King Uzziah died, yes. I saw also the Lord sitting upon a throne high and lifted up, now, and his train filled the temple. Stop right there. Stop right there. You got the text right. Give me Psalms 110. No, no, no. Stay where you're at. Wait, wait, explain wait, 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 wait. it. Wait, wait, wait. Let me explain. Who did Isaiah see? The Lord. The Lord. Who's the Lord? Jesus. He's, oh, 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 sitting on the throne. Yes. Well, who throne Jesus was sitting on then? That's his throne. Is he oh, God? God? Oh. If Jesus is sitting on the throne and the angels are saying, Kaddish, 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 what? holy, holy is the Lord. Yes. Who is he talking about? Jesus. Jesus. Oh, you know. Yes. Jesus is sitting on the throne. Where is this taking place? Where is it taking place at? The throne is heaven, is heaven. it not? So, in the beginning, so that means Jesus pre existed before he came down to the earth. Am I right? I agree. Thank you. Yes and no. Oh, oh, oh! Let me show you. Oh, oh yes, yeah, show me. Let me show you. Yeah, thank you. L let me help you out. Jesus is God. I agree. Uh huh. And He always exists. He exists before His body did. Right. Yes, true. Didn't it? Didn't it? All right. Now, let's see the nature of the body of Jesus. That's right. Romans chapter one. Follow me. And we'll start at I agree three. with you 100%. Jesus is on the throne yeah. and he always exists. Yeah. Was but he always just, on the throne? Oh, yes. Yes. Because Jesus is everlasting. Okay. But his body wasn't. That which was on the throne was not begotten. That which was on the throne was not begotten. What was begotten was flesh and blood. Right. What was on the throne have no beginning and have no ending. It's without father, it's without mother, and it have no beginning and have no ending. Is that the truth? Is that the truth? That's the truth? All right. Romans chapter 1. Romans chapter 1. And we'll start at verse 3. Romans 1 and 3 says, Concerning his son. Everybody be quiet. I want to certify my talk with Bible. Amen. I want to show you the nature of that body. That's right. You said that y'all don't believe he took on the body. That's what you said earlier. You said earlier that you don't believe he took on the body. That, no, that he created him by put himself in it. No. Oh, you said you don't believe that. Right, right. We don't believe that. Right. Y'all yeah. don't believe that. We I'm going to show you in the yeah. Bible that he did make a body and he did put himself in it. He put the son in there? No, he didn't put the son in there. Oh, no. The, what Aaron, that's a, ain't Jesus the son? Yes. Okay, so then he put the son in the body. No. Why? no. Oh, oh. No, no, I didn't say that. No, no. I'm saying why he didn't put the son in? Ain't the body the logo? Ain't the, the spirit no. the logos? Listen. Ain't Jesus the word? Let me explain to you. And he's the word. I'm explaining to ain't you the why. Ain't flesh? You want me to answer you? Yes, okay. The reason why he didn't put the son in the body, uh -huh. because the son was the body. Right. <laughs> Let me show you. Twist it up. That, Twist it up. Let, let me show you. Amen. Brother Smith, there's no need to put a son in the body. You got the Holy Ghost. Yes, I do. That's Jesus in you. Jesus in me. Is that right? Yes. So if Jesus in you, got the spirit in you. Uh -huh. It's not a son in you. That's right. We shall abode in you. That's what the, the text in John. Is that a son in you? We, God, 
in the Father, yes. God the Father, in the Son. We shall abode in you. All right. That's what the text says, right? Let's see we. if the Son That's what it says. Let's see if the Son is. Let's see, let's see what the Son consists of. First Follow Romans, me. Romans chapter 1, and we'll start at verse 3. I want to help my church of God in Christ brother out. Amen. He's somewhat on the right track. Somewhat. Oh. But, but the church of God in Christ really ruined him. Yeah. All right. And, and, and I want to say to your bishop, don't bother him when he go back. He's trying. You should have came here. That's right. All right, listen at this. Romans chapter 1 and at verse 3. Everybody keep quiet. Romans chapter 1 verse and verse three. 3. Concerning his son. I want to deal with the body and took on everything. Right. All right. Concerning his son. All right, listen. Concerning his son. His you son. agree? is recognized ownership. Yes, sir. So his son was be talking about God's son. Mm -hmm. Right. Concerning his son. Jesus Christ our Lord. What? Which was made. Wait a minute. Which was what? Which was made. When a thing is made, it got to have a beginning. It ain't talking about the spirit. No. The flesh, which was the body, was made. Which was Where? made. Which was made of the seed of David. The spirit of God is not of the seed of David because when you're of the seed of David, you descend from it. Right. God have no beginning. That's right. And God have no ending. That's so, right. which was made of, of the, the seed of David. According to what? According to the flesh. He was the son. According to what? According to the flesh. He was Mary baby. According to what? According to the flesh. All right. When God Almighty went to the house of David in order for us to be redeemed, some blood had to be shed. Uh -huh. And the spirit which is everlasting mm -hmm. perpetual and eternal didn't have no blood would mm -hmm. you agree yes. a sacrifice had to be offered he said sacrifice are offered that wood is not but a body I has thou prepared for me. is that what he said yes sir, sir. you just say he didn't make a body i said he didn't sacrifice an offering you say he didn't put himself in it hold it right there right there let's get hebrew let's see where sacrifice are offering mm -hmm. and then I want to get 2 Corinthians, 2 Corinthians. Chapter, five. chapter 5. Let's see the body first. First in Hebrews chapter 10. I want to help my brother. Hebrews Listen. chapter 10 and verse 5. Hebrews chapter 10 and verse 5. Wherefore when he cometh into the world. When he. Jesus. When Jesus cometh into the uh -huh. world. He saith. He saith. He said, Sacrifice and offering thou wouldest not. Uh -huh. Wait a minute. Sacrifice and offering, thou you wouldn't do not, it. So but, what happened? But a body. A what? A, a body. body. A what? A, a body. body. A what? A body. How did it get here? Hast thou prepared me? God prepared a body. Amen. Let, let me finish. Okay. After God prepared that body, let's see where God was located in the body. Follow me. Now in 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 19. All right. To wit that God was in Christ. Is that the truth? Yes, listen. Is that the truth? Yes, God was Is that in, the truth? That's the truth. Was right God there. in Christ yes, Jesus? Yes, he was. Was Christ Jesus yes, the son of God? Well, God was not just, in just himself. A minute. Just a minute. I didn't say that. Okay. I'm that's not saying that. No, that's what y'all teach, though. No, that is not what I teach. No. God was not in himself. That's not what I teach. No. Okay. I don't teach that. No. That's God. damnable doctrine. That's oneness yeah. doctrine. No. Listen. That's that's Bishop Johnson's doctrine. Don't. That's Bishop Bonner's doctrine. Am I Bishop Bonner? That's dead. Don't. Are you what debating you did. Bishop Bonner? You, listen. Listen. Yeah, no. No. Hold it. That's am I listen, Bonner? What Gino did, did. Or am I Jenny? Listen. Listen. What they say? He, Come on. He approved upon it. I did he, what? You see, you go away from Bishop Bonner, right? You don't I, teach what they teach. I didn't right? come from under no, them. No. You look. You. That's the one from them. That's the one. No. You that's know, the one. You know what's the one? No. You, that's what it comes from. I'm not apostolic. That's what it comes from. It did not. You offshoot. You offshoot. That's what it is. So, so what, you're trying to tell me oneness. Oneness came uh -huh. with Bonner and Johnson. Okay. No, it came out of the United Pentecostal. That's it did. It United Pentecostal. Let's see where oneness come from. Oh Lord, is oneness in the Bible? Give me Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy is chapter oneness 32. Oneness in the Bible. Give me Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy chapter 32. Give me Deuteronomy. 39. Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Deuteronomy chapter 6 and verse 4. Let's see where one come from. Amen. Is one this in the Bible? Let's see where one come from. Deuteronomy chapter 6 and verse 4. Says what? Hear, O Israel. I hear. I just quoted. Oh, Israel. The Lord our is, God. Is what? Is one Lord. I see. He Never did. mind, listen. Bonner. Just a minute. Listen. Just a minute. Wait, wait. Never mind, wait. Bonner. Wait. Never mind, Johnson. Listen. Amen. Before listen. they were born, Amen. God was one. One. God was one. Ladies and gentlemen. Now, 
My sister you misrepresented me. No, yes. Yeah. If I did, I apologize. I don't let like let me just straighten you out Listen. on what we believe. Okay. Because it'll be foolish you come yeah. here to debate a man Listen. and you ain't even clear on what he believes. Listen. I don't Listen. teach. Okay. Listen, let me straighten you out. Yes, sir. I don't teach mm -hmm. that God put the sun within the sun. Mm -hmm. No. The Bible ain't never taught that. Mm -hmm. No. I teach okay. that God, God the eternal spirit, according to the book of Corinthians. 2 Corinthians 5, 19. Says what? To wit that God was in Christ. With Doing what? Life. Reconciling listen. the world listen. unto himself. Look at your church name. Listen. Listen. Church of God right. in, in Christ. In Christ. Do you believe, believe your own believe. name? Listen. No, 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 no. Hold it. Answer the hold question. It. Yes, listen, hold it. Answer the hold question. It. Hold it. Was God in Christ? In Christ. Hold it. Hold it. No, listen, no. Listen, Answer God, the question, listen, Smith. Listen. Was God in Christ? God was, God in, was Christ. in Christ. Yes. We was believe Christ that. the Son of God? Yes, He was. Was the Son of God yes. flesh and blood? Then when I said that, listen. My, my, listen and listen, come back and answer listen, the listen. question. I was the it. Son of God flesh and blood? Yes, He was. Was the and flesh and blood it. a body? Yes, it was. Was God in that body? Yes. Yes, sir. The he was in that the body. Spirit of God. Yes, it was. Was he in that the body? Spirit of God. Yes, it was. So that's the truth. Yes, there was a union together. Yes, did the Bible say that. There was a union together. Did the Bible say that? One mean union. I did said the Bible that. say that? The Hebrew word "akad" means union. Give Bible chapter Deuteronomy verse six and four. Day. God was in you. Deuteronomy six and four. I don't want that. No, I used it. We used that. Want that. One mean union. God Once was again, in Christ. The Hebrew says one compound. Compound. How many? We'll go. One and one. What? In one. Get Bible for it. one. Get Bible. Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Get you, Bible. Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Get Bible. Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Three personalities. Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Smith. Let's go. Smith, listen. Let's go. Yeah. 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 Drum Smith. me up like listen, this. Listen, son. No, Deuteronomy listen. 6 and 4. You Let's was go. already trumbled up before you got no, here. No. Right. <laughs> Don't blame your confusion on me. No. You are a victim of the church of God. Listen, I no, got no. some ex-church of God and Christ members here. Amen. God and they them. came in with the same God bless rotten and no good God teaching bless. that you are a victim of. God Amen. bless them. Give Bible bless chapter and verse. Am I asking sir. too much? Can, let me, Am I asking too much? I use Deuteronomy 6 and 4. Am I asking too much? I'm giving the Bible 6 and 4. I wanted to say okay. that three okay. personalities. When I use the, when the, the word God is in the plural. Once again. Is he more than one? Again, it's three in one. Now, give Bible that says, listen, give Bible. Give, hold me out. Hold, hold, I want get, Bible, me, Smith. I'm going to give it. I give want me. it. Give me. I'm going to give it to you. All right, get the scripture. Yes, yes. So, let's go to John Six and thirty-eight. When you find a man calling a bunch of scriptures, bunch of scriptures. just to try to Relax. find one thing, Relax. you know he's lost. That's no. right. I'm staying he's with lost. my notes. I'm staying with my notes. You got your notes. Got your notes. All right. You John rely on your notes. I'm going to rely on the Bible. Okay. John six and thirty-eight. All right. John six thirty-eight. Let's see. Does that help him? John six and verse thirty-eight. All right. For I came down from heaven. Who came? Wait, wait, wait. Jesus came down from heaven, right? Yes. Was Jesus sent? Was he what? Was he sent? Yes. yes. Yes, he was. He was sent by the Father. Right. So how many perils in, in the garden? Now let's check this out. Read it. For I came down from heaven, yes. uh -huh. not to do mine own will, but oh, wait, 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 wait. So he had a will, right? Yes. He had his own prerogative okay. that he could have done, right? Right. But he didn't do it. He came down to do who will? Who will came down to do? He did the will of the Spirit. The, the will of the Father, right? Well, I the came spirit? down the from Father, heaven. Right? I agree. Okay, that's what the text says. How many is that? That's that's what it, what it says. Now read For I text. came down from heaven, uh -huh. not to do mine own will, uh -huh. yes. but the will of him that sent me. That sent me. How many is that? That's two. To what? Two. To what? Two personal speaking. Read it where the Bible say that. See? St. John chapter 12. See? Hold it. Read it. Uh, once again. Read it where the again, Bible says once that. Once again. St. John again, chapter we, 12. Come on back, Smith. Listen, listen. No. We don't on. play on words like that. That's Smith. a play on. Those are words. See, come look, back that's the philosophy. the Bible. That's the philosophy. You mean to tell me I'm philosophy. asking you for Bible? Listen. And you telling me that's philosophy? philosophy? That's the philosophy that you use. Give the scripture that's he read. That's the philosophy you use. Oh, chapter, John, verse, chapter 6 that's the philosophy. verse 38. I want all my viewers to listen. Right, viewers, hold it. Heaven. Let me educate you, viewers. When men like Smith, uh-huh, Come in your church, yeah. making statements, right. and they don't have no Bible for it. Amen. You know, like your pastor, Amen. demand him to show you what he say in that Bible. That's right. Jesus said, 
Jesus said, search what? Scriptures. Search what? Jesus. Scriptures. Search what? Scriptures. Would you take Jesus' advice? Because you don't want to listen to me. Would you take Jesus' advice? I'm searching the scriptures. All right. John 8, I want 42. you to search the scripture. John 8, and 42. And find for us John 8, the scripture 42. that says God have three, three. personalities. No, sir, Would you please once do again, that? Once again, I stay with the premise that we observe three persons uh, in give the Give me the Bible that says that. We I'm observe. We observe. We observe in the scriptures. All right. That's what we do. Will you please we get it for us? Okay, John 8, 42. All Once right, let's again. see where that scripture help him. Help him. John chapter 8 and verse 42. Let's see where that scripture help him. Do Jesus you want some said water? unto them. Do you want some water, son? Yes, sir. Please. You want some water? Yes, sir. All right. Calm down. Calm down, sir. Calm down. Here's one, two, three. This represents what you believe. You choose what you want. <laughs> that represents it. Represent what you believe. You get the one you want. Or one. Oh, get Lord. the one you want. I, I want the television viewers to observe. observe. I want you to observe what the Church of God in Christ believe. Right, right. This is what the Church of God in Christ believe. Right. A man that holds three bottles My and Lord. still say it's one. Right. I take that belief. And I blast it to hell. Amen. Listen at the Bible. St. John chapter, chapter 8 and verse 42. All right, listen at John 8, 42. Jesus said unto them. Jesus said to them. If God were your father, you would love me. If God were your father, you would love me. For I proceeded forth and came from God. I proceeded forth and come from God. Neither came I of myself, but he sent me. Once again. I agree 100%. Once again, so his two persons. Did the Bible say that? Listen, wait, wait, wait. Why listen, you keep wait. lying on the Bible? I don't, I don't, I don't, did you hear me say any about, did you hear me quote anything? You, okay. you made a statement. We, we, listen. That is two persons. We exegete that. from the Bible. Uh -huh. We exegete from the my exegete. We exegete. When you make your exegete, you better make your ex, your interest right back in there. Exegete from the Bible. We let the Bible talk, not us. We not talking. You're not. The Bible is talking. Then please. The Bible is talking. The Bible say not in your word. Personality. Not in your word. I want that. Not in your word. I want that. Not in your word, sir. Come on. Not in your word, sir. Not in your word, sir. Brother Smith. Not, not in your word. Should sir. we believe? Let me calm down. Look, not in your word. Listen, you can get as loud as you want, not son. It don't bother no. me at all. Amen. Not in your word, sir. You can get as not loud in, as you want. Not in your word. If that'll make you feel better, because no. you, your loudness, it ain't gonna save you. No. And it won't help you. No. Out of all your loudness, you will never find one scripture, not even a half of scripture, half of one. where it says there are three personalities. Amen. You see, that's what makes the Church of God in Christ teaching so vulnerable. Right. You make Let statements. Let me ask you a question. That's not, yes, ask me. In John 5 and 7, who bear witness? The Bible says there are three that bear witness. I mean three. Let's read this. First John chapter 5 and Let's verse 7. Let's read this and break it down. It's break one it of his down. scriptures. Amen. Let's see what this helps. All right. You First John 5 one. and verse 7. For there are three that bear record in heaven. When the Bible says there's three that bear record in heaven, record is something that's recorded. So there's something recorded about this one God. Right. What is it? There are three that bear record in heaven. Yes. The Father. That's God. Because he's the Father of all things. Uh -huh. and he's the originator of creation. The Word. That's God. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He's a God of His Word. And, and the Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost is the characteristics or the nature of God because the Holy Ghost is the Holy Spirit. And the Bible said it's one Spirit. And John 4, 24 said God is, is a spirit. spirit. Is that the, is that the truth? Is that the truth? God. The truth. Is that the truth? God is spirit, just like I said. God is spirit. God has no shape nor form. God is spirit. God is life, and God is light. That is true. Is okay. God three personalities? The, with the, with the, with the, the text the, 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 I don't want those no stammering. With the text, text said. With the text said. The text ain't said that. Well, there, there are three, three that bear 
record in heaven. What is the functions? Tell me the functions now. I, I'll show you the functions. Read Tell it. Me. For there are three that bear record in heaven. What is it? The Father. The Father. The function of the Father means master of creation, uh -huh. master of the day of judgment. He bears the title Father because he's the creator of the universe and creator of the, everything under the sun. Right. What else? The Word. 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 God is the Word because when he speaks, he makes things happen. By oh, his, just a hold it. That's not the truth. Listen, what? hold it. Hold That's it. not the truth. Hold it. John. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, when God speaks, does it happen? Sir. Listen. Who does the work? God do. The son does. He does? The son. Isaiah chapter All right. 44. I'm the glad you just, just a minute. The son does the work. Give me the book of John. John. He said the son do the work. Yeah. Let's mm. see what Jesus said. That's right. That's right. Everybody be quiet. Go ahead. Everybody be quiet. That's right. He said the son do the work. Right. I want the Bible to make him out of a liar. Amen. You're going to be a church of God in Christ liar this afternoon, Smith. That's right. You lied on Jesus. Amen. You said the son do the work. Amen. And you either going to take it back or say this is the truth. Listen Amen. to Jesus. St. John chapter 14 and verse 10. That's what? Believest thou not that I am in the Father? Jesus talking. Amen. Believest thou not I am in the Father? And the Father in me. And the Father in me. The words that I speak unto you. The words that I speak okay. unto you. I speak not of myself. Yes. But the Father that dwelleth in me. What do the Father do? He doeth the work. Does the Father do the work? <laughs> Answer the question. Now, the question is, lie? Listen, no, I didn't lie. You said the son do the work. Wait, the son? No, listen, no, 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 it, no. It, Don't go it, reading it, nothing no, else. Wait, wait, wait. No, wait, no, wait, wait, no, no. Down. You plainly Let said, me, get, listen, just a minute, listen, just a minute, there's let, a scripture John, on the floor. John, That's one, right. No, we, get, ain't, we ain't John, reading nothing else. Here we go. Check this out. No, we're going to check this we, out. But the I'm going to explain that. Just a minute. Let me explain that. Just a minute. No. Let me explain that. I'll let you let you Smith. I'll let you exegete. Smith. Let me, let me exegete, sir. Smith. Let me oh, exegete, Lord. sir. Smith. Let me exegete, sir. Did you let me tell the listen, truth let when me, you said see, the son let me exegete, do the work? Let me exegete, sir. Answer the viewing let me, audience. Let me exegete and that. And answer the hundreds let that me, are here. Let me, ex yeah. let me exegete that. Did he that say text. the son do the work? Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes. Is that what yeah. he said? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I said that. Did you no, tell yes. the truth or yeah. did you tell a lie? Let me exegete that, sir. No. You ain't going to exegete nothing. Answer my question. So when Jesus, did I said that. you I said tell that. Yes, the I truth? Yes, I did. Did you tell a lie? But the but Father that dwelleth in me. Did you lie? No, no, I did not. What did Jesus say? But the Father that dwelleth in me, he doeth the work. Smith so said the Son do the work. Who's the liar, Smith? Listen, wait, calm down. What works? No, 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 no. What works? Was the works on earth? Who's the liar? Was the works on earth? Smith. Was the works on earth? Who's the liar? What works was he talking about? But the works that he was doing me, on the earth. The he works with the works. The works the, that was on the earth. The Bible says what? That the was on the earth. That dwelleth in me. When he healed the he man. With the works. When he healed the man. Who did it? Listen, the father that dwelleth listen, in me. When he he did the works. Oh, hear me out. What did the Bible say? The father that out. dwelleth in me. Hear me out. He doeth the works. Yes. What did the Bible yes. say? The, the father, father that dwelleth in listen. me. He doeth the works. What did the Bible say, church? Listen. 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 What did the Bible say? Listen. Here you go. Thank you. Somebody Thank you. is a liar. That's a lie. When Jesus was on earth, Smith. when he healed blind Bartimaeus, that was done Smith. through the, the Father, the works on the earth. Smith. Yes, the Father does the work. Smith. When he healed the, the Sarephian woman, he did, the Father did the works. My Lord, yes, my Lord. God did the works. Smith. When he, he, calm down, sir. When Smith. he, with the man with the withered arm. Smith. The man with the withered arm, when Jesus, when Smith. the Father did the works. My Lord, my Lord. The Smith. Father on the works. Yes, the Father did the did works. Did you tell a earth. lie? No, Amen. I did not. I you did not said lie. the Son done the work, the work. and the Son the Bible admitted said, that the, the father, father who lied, the father Wait, no, that dwelleth in me, who lied. I didn't lie. I didn't lie. Did he Jesus did the lie? Work. The father did the works on earth. Did Who's Jesus the lie? Oh, Lord. Wait, you hear what I'm saying? Did you hear what I'm Jesus saying? lie? Look, Jesus don't lie. Listen, listen. Somebody lied. Did, no, Jesus don't lie. Did you lie? What I said was, 
the works that Jesus I was know, doing, Lord, it was through the Father, it's not me, but the Father, of course, Dude, on earth. You lied. But then when, when the world was created, all right, all right. Jesus' work made the Church, world. did he lie? Yes. No, I wouldn't do that. You lied. I wouldn't do that. You I did. Wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that. You know why you lied? No, and I, you want to know why say? it's so easy for you say? to lie? What did I because say? Because you was taught wrong. Listen, no. You were taught wait, wrong. Wait, wait, wait. That's why you lied. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. What I said... I said, my first word, I said that Christ, Christ did the works. No. The no, making of the heavens and earth. Yes, he did, did the works. Who did? Who do it? Do the sun. Yes. The world was made through the sun. Wait a minute. Yes. All right, just a minute. Principalities. The sun, yes. the, the sun made heaven and earth? Man, yes. That's Flesh what and said. blood made heaven and earth? Isaiah. No. The, pre, the Logos made it. All the right, Logos. Let me, let me ask you a the question. The Logos made it. John 1 and 1. First what? John 1 and 1. First John 1 and 1. Please. All right, let's read John 1 and 1. For St. John maybe, chapter maybe 1 and 1. Maybe that'll help him. Amen. St. John chapter 1 and verse 1. Yes. In the beginning was the Word. Yes. The, and the Word was first, with God. 1 John 1 and 1. Sorry. 1 first John 1 and 1. 1 first John chapter 1 and verse Smith, 1. None of, the, none of the scriptures you got no, helped I'm you in the yet. lion's den. No. None of them helped you yet, son. We're good. None of them helped you yet. First now, you John, can read first John, all day, but first John 1 and 1. ain't nothing you're going to get to back up what you're saying. First John 1 and 1. All right, let's see what that help him. First John chapter 1 and verse 1. That which was from the beginning. The yeah. who was, which wait, 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 wait. Slow down. Who was from the beginning? God. Wait. Amen. <laughs> I dare you to say he wasn't from read the, the beginning. Read the text. Read the text. You just that asked me from the, the beginning. Read the, right. text. read the text. Read the text. Yes. Read the text. What did he say? That which was from the beginning, uh -huh. which we have heard. Which we heard. Which we have seen with we our seen. eyes. Did any man sing God in yes. Utah? Yeah. Want me to prove it? As a spirit? Yes. As a spirit? Yes. yes. They yes. sing God spirit with you. Yes. They sing God as a spirit. Please yes. ask me to prove it. Okay. Prove that. Please. They sing God. Yes. Face yes. to face. Yes. Face to face. Yes. Wait, give yes. me with Moses. Tell how he saw God. Yes, yes. Exodus chapter 24. Just a minute. Wait, wait. Listen. Lord, just a minute. Lord. He asked me to give him Bible. I know the scripture. Just, 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 just a minute. Where anybody Amen. saw God face, face to, to face. face. Exodus chapter 24. All right, I want you to hear. And we're at verse 9. Oh, I'm going to give you a belly full today, son. Amen. You better drink some water to wash down the gospel that we're giving you. Amen. All right. Exodus chapter 24, we'll start at verse 9. Get me. Then went up Moses and Aaron, Nadab and Abihu, and yes. 70 of the elders of Israel. All right. And they saw the God of Israel. Yes. And there was under his feet, as it were, paved work of a sapphire stone. Yes. And as it were, the body of heaven in his clearness. They saw God as it were. And they saw the God of Israel. Yes. And it was under his feet, as it were, a paved work of a sapphire stone. Yes. And as it were, of the body of heaven in his clearness. Did they see God? Or did they see flesh? They seen God. That's they seen God? Says. That's what the Bible said? That's what the Let's keep says. traveling. Genesis chapter 32. And we'll start. Come Gen on, son. Genesis chapter 32. And I'm right at verse 30. Says what? And Jacob called the name of the place Penel. Jacob. Call the name of the place Penel. For I have seen God. How did he see God? Face to face. Is that the truth? Don't you try Amen. to give me some explanation either. Amen. Is that the truth? That's what the Bible says. Is that the truth? That's what the Bible says. Is it the truth? That's the truth. Amen. So you lied. Amen. It's the truth. God told Moses, no man can see my face in what? I have seen God face to face. Listen, listen. No, listen. Listen, you better quit while you're here. Jesus said in John 1 and 18. All right, I want, you, I want everybody to listen. No man has seen God. Help. No man has seen God at any time. And did what? Only begot, only the begotten son. All right. Which is from the bosom now let me help of you. the Father. Would you let me help you now? No. Now. That's an excellent scripture you read. No, so who's lying, Moses or Jesus? Neither. Neither. I want to help you. You see, in order to understand the Bible, uh -huh. you got to make it harmonize. Right. Now, I want to show you his scripture, 
St. John 118. And then I want to get John, I believe, 646. 46. Amen. I want to make it harmonized Amen. to give you a better understanding of what you just read. Right. Because what you read, I agree with 100%. Right. But I want to help you with it. Okay. All right, listen. St. John chapter 1 and verse 18. That's what? No man has Wait seen. a minute. No man. No what? No man. Just a minute. No man. No man. Have seen God. At any time. At any time. At any time. Now, wait a minute. No man. No man. Have seen God. At any time. At any time. At any time. Same book. Same book. John 6, 46. St. John chapter 6 and verse 46. It's going harmonizing. Not that any man oh, had seen the Father. It's not just any man had seen the Father. That's seen the Father. Save he. Save he or accept he. Which is of God. That's of God. He, he had seen, had seen the, Father. the Father. So not just, not just any man. So Let me help you. That, uh, in, not in just text. any man have seen the Father. Save he which is of God. He had seen he the Father. Has seen the Father. Who's the of God? Huh? Who's the of God? The of God are those that are people of God. Okay. Now let me show you in the Bible some of those that was of God that actually saw God. Amen. Let's go to work. First in the Kings, Old Testament. First Kings. Parliament. 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 I want to show my brother in the Bible. Those that was of God right. that seen God. That's right. Oh, I want to give you a belly full. That's right. Come on, son. First Kings 22 at verse 19. All right, and then I want to answer your question. Can anybody see a spirit? Right. I'm going to give you a Bible where not only someone saw a spirit, it saw the movement of the spirit. That's right. And their body reacted to the spirit. That's right. I'm going to show you that. Amen. Listen. First Kings 22 and verse 19. All right. And he said, hear thou therefore the word of the Lord. Give chapter and verse again. First Kings chapter 22. And we're at verse 19. Parliament. And he said, hear thou therefore the word of the Lord. What is it? I saw the Lord. I saw the Lord. Sitting. Sitting. On his throne. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know you can't see that with the natural eye. Amen. You've got to be in the spirit right. to see the things of the spirit. That's right. For the Bible said the things of God no man know right. but the spirit of God. Right. So a man got to be put in the spirit That's to right. see the things of the spirit. That's right. Don't you hear the Bible said the holy men of God speak as they was moved by the Holy Ghost? Amen. So here's a man moved, moved by the spirit of God to see the things of God. That's All right. right. And he said, hear thou therefore the word of the Lord. All right. I saw the Lord sitting on his throne. I saw the Lord sitting on his throne. And all the hosts of heaven standing. By God, him. Here's a man looked in heaven by the Spirit. I trust what he said. That's right. All right. And all the hosts of heaven standing by him. All the hosts of heaven standing by him. Standing on his right hand. It was on his right hand. And on his left. And on his left. And the Lord said. And look at the conversation he had. And the Lord said. The Lord said. Who shall persuade Ahab uh -huh. that he may go up and fall at Ramoth Gilead? Yes. And one said on this matter and another said on that matter. All right. And there came forth a spirit. What came? And there came forth a spirit. If he couldn't see it, how could he tell us what it was? Mm -hmm. What came? And there came forth a spirit. And what did the spirit say? And stood before the Lord. Was, was it a divine? Was it a demonic spirit? What? Or was it Listen, a heavenly spirit? There is no demons in heaven. Would you not agree? When mm -hmm. God put out Satan, mm -hmm. the third that joint with Satan came out also. Yeah, no, I agree. So everything up there is holy, is it not? Yeah. Is it clean? Yeah. So there ain't no demons do up they, there. Do they go back to God? Do they present themselves to God? No, they don't go back to God. Do they present themselves? They can present themselves to God, but that don't mean they go to heaven because no, God is everywhere. That's what I'm saying. That's in which realm? Which realm is that? That's a what? That which realm the is that? The Bible don't say which realm. That's a spiritual realm. The Bible don't say which it's realm. It's a spiritual realm. But they can see a spirit. And, yeah. and, and they can't go realm. to heaven because the Bible says they this. The Bible says their place okay. was not found anymore. And if it's not found anymore, they can't go back. Right. Are, you, are we clear? All right, come on, son. And there came forth a spirit. There came forth a spirit. And stood before the Lord. And stood before the Lord. And said, I will persuade him. I will persuade him. And the Lord said unto him, How are you going to do it? And he said, I will go forth. And be a lion spirit in, in the, the mouth, mouth of all his prophets. Give me the book of Job. Now in the book of Job, chapter 4. I want to show you where a man was of God. Right. Not only did he see the spirit. He saw the movement of it. That's right. And his body reacted. That's right. I want this to be good for every preacher watching that dare insult my intelligence and accept the ability of God in saying you can't see a spirit. See a spirit. Man, when God get a hold of you, God can make you see what he wants you to see. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Job chapter, chapter 4. 
And we're at verse 12. Job 4.12 says, Now a thing was secretly brought to me. A thing. A Let's thing. it be the name of God a today. A thing was secretly a brought thing to me. Was secretly brought to, brought me. to me. And mine ear received a little thereof. My ear got a little bit of it. And thoughts from the visions of the night. Then what? When deep sleep falleth on me. I was thinking about a vision that I had that night. Fear came upon me. Then fear came on me. And trembling. And I started trembling. Which made all my bones to shake. While I was in that state, what happened? Then a spirit passed before my face. Wait a minute. Amen. You taught you can't see a spirit. Amen. They don't know what they're teaching you. No. The Bible says. Then a spirit passed before my face. Then what? The hair of my flesh stood up. Then what? I stood still. I, what? I stood still. I stood still. It stood still. What did it say? It stood still. Read it again. There is a spirit before my face. Read it the whole thing right. What did it say? Now a thing was secretly brought to me. A thing was secretly brought to me. And mine ear received a little thereof. My ear received a little of it. In thoughts from the visions of the night. Then what? When deep sleep falleth on men. Yes. Fear came upon me. I got afraid. And trembling. And? Which made all my bones to shake. Then what? Then a spirit. Then a spirit. Passed before my face. If I can't see a spirit, how do I know it's moving? It passed before my face. The hair of my flesh stood up. My body reacted. It stood still. What? It stood still. Did he saw when his spirit yes. stood still? He saw the form of it. What else? It stood still, but I could not discern the form thereof. It was a spirit, but I couldn't identify the form of it yeah. and, and the shape of it. But it didn't change the fact it was a spirit. An image. You see, God have a lot of forms. I show you that in the book of Hosea. Right. Finish that up, son. An image. A image. Was before mine eye. It was an image. And it was before what? Mine eye. Before mine what? Eye. Mine eye. Before what? Mine eye. Before what? Mine eye. It was before his eyes, son. Amen. What did it say? And it, th thereof an, an image was before mine eyes. It was before my eyes. There was silence. And I heard a voice say. Uh-oh. Why this? image that I couldn't make out the shape of it mm -hmm. a voice spoke from it shall mortal man, shall mortal man be more just than God be more just than God shall a man be more pure than his maker don't tell me you can't see a spirit if you're of God God can put you in the spirit and can see the spirit That's right. when Jesus come to, for the church is flesh and blood coming from heaven or is it the Lord himself the Lord himself is it going to be flesh or is it going to be spirit it will be his body his what his body is the body human or divine? It's the divine body. Is the divine body? Yes, sir. Is the spirit? No, it's not spirit. It's not spirit? No, God body. is not a spirit? God is a spirit. What is the body? It's flesh. Flesh is in heaven? Yeah. Yes, Jesus. Flesh is in heaven? Yeah. Jesus. Just a minute. Jesus. Just a minute. Just a minute. First Corinthians. Just a minute. He said flesh is in heaven. In heaven. Let's read this. First Corinthians chapter 15. And at verse 50. Now this I say, brethren. This I say, brethren. That flesh and blood. Take your time and read it. Now this I say, brethren. That what? That flesh. Hold it. He said flesh is up there. Right. The Bible Jesus says, this I say, there. brethren. That flesh. That flesh. And blood. And blood. Cannot inherit. It cannot do what? Cannot inherit. Where? The kingdom of God. That's, that's a true statement. Yes. Is flesh up there? No. I said, Jesus, the resurrected body of Jesus Christ is up in heaven. Yes. Is it flesh? Okay. It's resurrected. Oh, you're changing your words now, huh? Amen. You're you changing your words. The resurrected body. Resurrected so it's not body. flesh. It's a resurrected body. It was a glorified. It was a glorified body. A spiritual body. A spiritual body. And it's not natural. It's not natural. And Mary natural. cannot be the mother of a glorified body, yes. can she? No, she can't. Exactly. Exactly. Ladies. Amen. Amen. Brother Smith, thank you for coming. Thank you, huh? Can I conclude? Yes, you can conclude. Yeah. Let's hear the conclusion. Truth of the whole God, matter. saints of God, I thank you for this opportunity. You agree? You got a great apostle here. Give him a hand, please. Like I said, I wasn't sent by the Church and God in Christ. I came out of my own volition, and I wrote the letter. The, the harm in my skills, and really, I am very impressed with this man. So, is my, is my, is my debating skills flawed, or do you take that back? I take that back, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for being here, brother.
God bless you, man. God bless you. All right, disconnect this microphone. All right. Disconnect this microphone, please. Now, I thank God for him being here, and I thank God for his honesty. He is a disciple of the Church of God in Christ. Yeah. And he was simply trying to defend what he was taught. Right. So rightfully enough, I cannot blame him. Right. Am I right, I say? Amen. So that brings us to this. Amen. Church of God in Christ. Yeah. All of you bishops. Brother Smith. You ready to go back? You don't want to say? All right. But, but I tell you what. Take your water. You want some more water? Your brothers walk them out. I say there's not a gospel in the world. Hallelujah. That's better than what God gave his apostles. That's right. And holiness is that. Amen. Now, you church of God in Christ. You church and God in Christ, bishops and elders, the challenge is to you big boys. You know who's driving Cadillacs after you robbed your members. Amen. Am I right? Amen. Who's living in mansions after you bamboozled your churches. Amen. Don't you think it's about time for you to prove to the folk that you are worthy yeah. of that yacht, Amen. of that Bentley, yeah. or of that mansion? So this is a challenge to all the Church of God in Christ bishops, elders, overseers, diocese bishops, district elders, Junior pastors, I don't care what you call yourself. Amen. You may say, well, Pastor Jennings, you had the home field advantage. All right, because I realize the word don't change, invite me in your pulpit. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We preach there's no God but one. No God but one. We preach there's no God with us. God with him. No God besides him. God beside him. In order for us to be redeemed, God that made the world sent the prophets ahead of his flesh, ahead of his body. Yeah. Made a body, and the body was called son. Son. Servant. Mediator. Mediator. Lamb. And when he got in that body, that represent him stepping in the church. That's right. Because now we, the sons, the sons of, God. of God. So the church of God in Christ say, God ain't make a body, mm. and then God in the body. Oh Lord. We proved it. Proved it. It's in there. Wherefore? Sacrifice an offering thou wouldest not. But a body. But a body. That's not prepared. Man. And the body that was prepared was the Son of God. That's right. After he prepared it. And made it, then he took it on. To wit, the Bible says, to wit, that God was in Christ. He, let, listen, he didn't even realize his own church name. Church of God in, in Christ. Christ. Church of God in, in Christ. Christ. God was in. Do you hear the Bible? In 2 Corinthians 5 and verse 19. To wit, to wit, that God was in Christ. God was in Christ. Reconciling the world unto himself. And if God was in Christ, God was in the body. Right. Don't you hear the Bible says, greater the mystery of godliness, God was manifested in the flesh. When God was in that body, God was in Christ, God was in that flesh. And while he was in that flesh, he was manifesting himself. That's right. What was he doing? Manifesting his power. Right. That's why he was able to walk on water. Yeah. On his own, he couldn't do it, Farrakhan. Right. On his own, he couldn't do it. That's right. So he manifests himself in, in the it flesh. and then made the body defy right. the laws of gravity. That's right. Walk on water? Amen. 
Ain't no natural body can walk on water no, unless no. it's ice. Yeah. Walked on water and yet the wind was blowing. That's right. Waves tossed him. Yeah. And here's Jesus. Walking on the water. Here's Peter. Let me come on Let out there with out. you. He said, come on. Come on. Now, someone said, well, wait a minute. Peter wasn't Jesus. Then how could he walk on water? Yeah, I can hear you. Because he believed. That's right. What Jesus said. That's right. And when you believe what Jesus said, he told his apostles yeah. that the works that I do shall ye do also. Shall ye do also. And greater, greater works, works than these shall ye because do. Because I go unto my father. Go back to the father. That's right. So God is not three persons. No. The moment you make that statement, you violate right. Revelation 22, 18. Revelation 22 and verse 18. You violate the church of God. Listen, not only the church of God in Christ, anybody else. That's right. Anybody else. Amen. That says there's a trinity. I'll make you lick it up. Amen. You know, Moses took that calf and beat it to dust and strolled it everywhere and they licked that dust up. Right. I take your three distinct personalities, blast it into hell and make your bishop lick it up. That's right. What did he say? Revelation 22 and verse 18. What did the apostle say? For I testify unto every man. I testify. I testify. To every man. That heareth the words of the prophecy of this book. And what? If any man shall add unto these things. Now the moment you said three personalities, you said something the Bible didn't say, That's so you add it. Add it. Uh -huh. If any man shall add unto these things, if any man shall add unto these things, God shall add unto God him shall add unto the him plagues that are written in this the book. The plagues that are written in the book. And, and if any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, you see, he got up with Greek. That's what happened. You go studying all these languages, and then they make you contradict the Bible. That's right. Knowing more than one language is good, Amen. but if they're gonna make you lie on God, you might as well close up your Greek, your Hebrew, and your Latin. That's right. Because I don't care what language you speak. It's one God. Still one God. Uh, uh, come here, Brother Elvis. Uh, uh, say it's one God in your language there in Mauritius. And you. One God. Say it right here. And you. One God. One God. And how you say it? And you. And you. And you. One God. One God. Come here, Brother Abraham. <laughs> Tell me it's one God in your language. Un Dios. How many? Un Dios. It's still one. Un Dios. One. Un Dios. Come here, Bishop Benjamin. I want you to speak your native language and tell him it's one God. Wakka Devudu. Wakka Devudu. Telugu. Wakka Devudu. Wakka Devudu. Wakka Devudu. One God. One God. Yeah. Brother Farrakhan, do you still remember some of the Arabic language? Can you say one God in Arabic? Please say it in the Arabic tongue, please, for me, brother. Tell the folk it's one God in Arabic. Say, so He is God, one and only. <laughs> Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This is one of our new brothers who was in the nation of Islam for 23 years. Brother Raheem Farrakhan went down in the water in the name of Jesus Christ and received the baptism of the Holy Ghost. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There is one God. One alone. Just one. One alone. One. Any religion that have more than one, your religion is fraud. Fraud. That's no good. No good. Amen. No good. He, he knew he would lose when he got here. Amen. You try to come here in the truth of God nest <laughs> where all these one birds reside. That's right. Everybody chirp one God here. Amen. God is of the language. God is one. Amen. Now, before he got here, 
we gave him an ultimatum. We told him that if he can't prove that the Bible says it's three separate and distinct, he must agree to repent before the public and be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. That's why he got out of here quick. He want to do that. Amen. But being that he didn't want to do it, all right, you sinners that are here. You sinners, you know you of the devil, God knows. Hallelujah. It's time for you to get your life right with God. Amen. So far in this wonderful convention, 13 went down in water. In the name of Jesus Christ. Is there anyone else who desire to get their life right with God? I want to be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. Stand on your feet. Anyone? If not, we thank you for listening. It's been a good meeting, God knows. All right, before you start moving, before you start moving, I want everybody's attention. Our photographers, I want all of my photographers to leave now so there is no delay, all of you. All the photographers go out to the front of the church. We want to take a photo shoot because this is our one year anniversary here on our campus. One year. And I want everybody upstairs in the back and that are here. Don't stand around to shake hands. Don't stand around to talk. I want you to go out every door and go to the very front of the church and line up behind the rose bushes and on the steps. Everybody consider yourself dismissed. Go out right away. Don't linger around so we can get this done. Please turn that off. Service will start tonight at 6 o'clock. Thank you for listening, brothers and sisters. Let's move quick. Please get the doors open. Let's move quick. Everybody to the front.